Now on the road to reopening New York State, once the epicenter of the pandemic, today only reported two new deaths. But elsewhere in the country, the pandemic continues to spiral out of control. Ten new states were added to New York, New Jersey's quarantine list. Connecticut is expected to follow suit. A total of 31 states are now on that list. Minnesota has dropped off. Governor Cuomo also giving new details about his crackdown on bars that violate social distancing policies. He says the state has suspended 27 licenses, including some establishments in our area. Eyewitness News reporter Dave Evans is live this afternoon in Astoria with details. Dave? Sandy, as you mentioned, the governor today began with some good news, saying that only two people died in all of New York yesterday from coronavirus, and that is a record low number since all this began. But then he turned to bars and rest restaurants and announced that four local establishments are having their liquor licenses revoked. That includes Brick Bar here on Steinway in Astoria. They are still open, but they can only serve food, uh, takeout food only. As for liquor, for right now, none at all. The governor has warned us many times before, even at one point saying, don't make me come down there. He's been alarmed with what he's seen in the city, and this weekend in Astoria, it was out of control. So today, Governor Cuomo brought the hammer down, suspending the liquor license of four restaurants and bars, three in Queens, and one on Long Island. And this is now a significant problem, and local governments have not been doing the enforcement. The governor today said bar owners just don't get it, that the rules were relaxed for restaurants and for outdoor dining, but not for bars serving liquor only. Uh, now, I understand bars are under terrific economic pressure, as are many other organizations, uh, and they took this outdoor dining as an opportunity to do outdoor drinking, but that's not what the regulations intended, right? The governor's also warned city and county governments to crack down on out-of-control bars on the weekend, but so far that really hasn't happened. Neighbors along Steinway today said they welcomed the governor's get-tough attitude. But the pictures I saw on social media indicated that things were way out of hand. It looked like a big black party. Does that worry you? Of course. New York has done such a good job of squashing corona. I think it's irresponsible of the business owners to be greedy and to let people just get out of hand. I think they should listen to the governor's advice and we should stay safe. And also today, the governor added 10 lists to the number of states where you have to quarantine if you come from one of those states into New York or New Jersey. Those states added today included states like Missouri, Washington State, also Nebraska. That brings to 31 the number of states that you have to quarantine once you do come into New York or New Jersey. Minnesota, by the way, they were dropped off that list today because the number of coronavirus cases there in Minnesota, uh, that is now dropping. For